and Max Max and Ruby Ruby and me, Ruby and me, Ruby and me, Ruby and me, Max and Ruby So, today is going to be a little vlog because we got out of school at 12. It is now 12.45, or we got out at like 12.15, and we left the school at like 12.20, and got some popcorn with chocolate syrup. It's actually good, so don't, don't, okay, we're going to try it. Mm. It's really good. It tastes amazing. So don't knock it till you try it, okay? It's really good. And we got out of school early today because it's supposed to be snow and maybe even a snowstorm. It's not snowing right now, but it's very cold. I hope the popcorn doesn't get stuck in my braces. Cause that'd be really bad, so. Hello, everybody. It's the next day, and it is currently... Uh, well, it's not snowing right now, but it was this morning, and, uh, like, early this morning. And as you can see, we have more snow than what we did yesterday, and just a few clips from yesterday was what we had, um, when it just started. But now, after a day of full-on snow, it's been basically a storm, and there's been on and off flurrying, and on and off heavy snow and heavy hail, so this is what we're working with today and I don't have school because of this and the roads were very bad this morning and during the night. So that's why we didn't have school of course and yeah so this is what my view is from my backyard. You can just see how snow covered the bushes and the trees are and my deck is filled with snow and the table is very high with snow. Um, and I actually touched the snow last night and my hand was, it felt like frostbite. It was super cold. I just always forget how it feels because we haven't had it in so long. So here's an up close shot of what the table looks like and see it's like, it's wet snow, but like, I feel like wet snow could be good for packing because this is very packed snow. I don't know if you can like tell uh, the difference between packed snow and snow that's not that packed but I have my Uggs on because um well I have to see if my snow boots fit because they might not fit and if they don't then I can't go out in the snow okay sorry about like my hair and everything but um I didn't shower yet because if I go out in the snow I'm just gonna shower after because that makes no sense to shower before I hope my phone isn't about to die because that would really stink nope I'm good I'm at 68% so we're we're good Oh my god. Even if I had an actual camera, I don't think I'd bring it out in this weather because it's just like a hazard. Like, I wouldn't want to drop my camera in the snow. But like, your phone can survive that. But like, a camera, I don't know. I wouldn't risk it. Especially if it's over uh, $400 or $300. Okay, so we're just walking. Um, it's deep. It's pretty deep. Um, I'll show you. I think you can tell it's pretty deep um, and I'm going to take some pictures for Instagram and post them probably tomorrow or later today. I mean, no, because I just posted on Instagram, so either tomorrow or the next day or something. Okay, so I took about four pictures and um, they came out pretty nice. I'm going to edit them a little bit and put some filters and whatever if I have to to make it look more Christmassy, I guess, or like, I don't know, more artsy. But I might take some more pictures to post on my Visco 
and if you don't follow me on that already it'll be in the description so that you can go follow it it's not only people from my school that follow it you can follow it too i hope this video gets more interesting like baking cookies or something because i really just don't want to vlog out here and like the whole day and get even more sick than i already feel and also it's not enough snow to uh snowboard well actually yes it is but like i feel like i'll do that later on when it's like the evening or like late afternoon definitely before it gets dark because it's only like 11 right now so it's not like i have to rush or anything oh god um but i do have homework but tomorrow's saturday if I do post those Instagram pictures by the time this video goes up, then they'll be on my Instagram, of course, and it'll be in the description, like my username, not the pictures. Um, so go follow that. And my Snapchat, I don't really anymore accept people from YouTube because if I don't know you, then I don't want you on my Snapchat. It's just for people in my school and it's just for people in my family and my friends that I do know but not in my school. So, um, I don't really like to do that anymore. I know in my last video I probably did that. And it's in my outro also, and you could do it if you want. It's just, if you don't do it, it's not a big deal. I'd rather you go follow my Instagram. Okay, guys, so I'm making chocolate chip cookies, homemade, though. I have the KitchenAid mixer over here. Um, you need one cup of butter, so that means two sticks. And it's softened. It has to be softened. How many eggs do you need? Um, two. So, yeah. And this will be for the dry. And the KitchenAid is for the wet. So I'll just put wet ingredients in there. So here is the cookie batter. We just put in M&M's, um, chocolate chips, and broken up Hershey bars. Like mini fun size ones because we didn't have enough chocolate chips. But um, we have like one and a half cups of chocolate in the batter and it re looks really good. And we're trying to figure out if we have to spray something or put something down to like bake the cookies on. And what we're going to use to put the cookies on the cookie sheet is this because it's big enough and we don't want them really big. So they are now in the oven. I was going to have like hot cocoa or something, but I'm just having my water. Yeah, my tongue is blue because I've been eating this, like, Jolly Rancher stick thing. It's from my Halloween candy. But it's just blue raspberry Jolly Rancher stick. Don't mind that I have my headphones on, but I'm just going to get a plate, get a cookie, and eat it. And get milk because you can't have a cookie without milk. It's not that small. Okay, if you need some homemade cookies, come to me. Look at that.